Right, we're going to do a simple installation with the installation simulator. So we just go up here and add a new circuit, choose our point of attachment. In this case we use a transformer, we c won't keep our high voltage details, so we'll just go next. Right, an isolator there, load current, 500 amps. Okay, it's going into a transformer, down here. Give it an ID, call it transformer. Alright, the load current on it, 500 amps. And we click next. So we add a new circuit to that. Off our transformer, click next here. An isolator, 500 amps, and click next. Okay, so this is onto our cable now. We'll have to give this cable a name. Simply, simply call them mains. It's three phase, copper, 400 volts. The length of that run, 57 meters. The current on that run, 500 amps. XLPE 90 degrees in singles and it'll be on a cable tray. We come down here now and click calculate. Right, we've got a 500, me 500 amp circuit and a 500 amp CB so we click OK. Would we like to use more than one core per phase? We can select yes here. Right, there's many options to choose from. Right, all our details are up there. We've got a 500 amp circuit. The length of the run is 57 meters so we want something we can have 295s here at 64.9 degrees, 1.44% volume drop, which is probably going to be fine. So we'll use that one. And we click next. So we go to an isolator, 500 amps, goes to our main board, and we'll just call it main distribution board, 500 amp load. Click next. All right. As you can see, we've got a transformer and our main distribution board in line. So we can add a new circuit now. Off our main distribution board, we'll click next. Another isolator. Make this circuit 100 amps. Click next. Give this cable a name. Call it office mains. It'll be single phase, 230 volts. Length of that run, 24 meters current on that load, the load on that run, 97 amps, XLPE 90 degrees, that will be clipped direct in singles. Okay, we can come over here and calculate that. All right, it's given us a 25 mil. We go straight through there, click next. Method of isolation, it's 100 amps load. Okay, we're going into a switchboard. All right, and we'll call this one Office DB 97 amps of load. Click next. Can add another circuit now, of course, straight off our main distribution board. Click next. An isolator. Make this our isolator 400 amps. Click next. All right, we need an ID for this cable. Pump room mains. Right, it'll be three phase, 400 volts, length of that run, 34 meters. The load on that run, 400 amps. XLPE 90, singles, clip direct. So we go over here and calculate that. It's a 400 amp load, 400 amp breaker, click OK. We would like to use more than one corporate phase, we can click OK here. Right, we've got a choice again of 295s. 52.6.69 volumes drop. We could probably go to 270s. That's uh, 63.4 degrees C at 0.91% volumes drop. We'll click OK on that. All right, then click next. All right, we have an isolator. It's going to go down into a distribution board, pump room, DB. 400 amp load, 400 amp CB. Click next on that. Okay, that's how simple it is. As you can see now, we've got our transformer here, our main distribution board. Down below that, we have our office distribution board and our pump room distribution board. That's how easy it is. Okay, many variations. Enjoy.